In the previous module, we developed our two-factor linear model and looked at each component of this linear model, specifically how we extract information about the overall effects of each factor and how we extract information about the interaction. Let's turn now to how we'll test these designs using Jump, and we'll stick with the same data set we worked through in order to develop our model, my times to campus on the basis of two factors, what time of day and what route to campus I was taking. I'll note that this is called a two by two design because each of our factors has two levels. That is, there are two different routes under consideration and two different times of day. If you have the journal that accompanies this module, click on times to campus two by two under the data section. Here we see the data set for our different times to campus measurements. You'll see we have 80 rows in this data set, which represent 20 observations for each condition. Let's look first at the overall distributions of our data. This is a great way to start with any new data set because you want to make sure that you have consistent numbers in each of your groups, or at the very least have observed each combination of factors. So let's start by using Analyze Distribution. And what I'll do is take all of my columns and cast them into the Y roll. Next I'll click OK, and we'll be able to look at the overall distributions for each of our columns.